Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to do interesting and creative GIFs. Let's get started. Just to keep it simple, I'm just going to add in titles. So first of all, I'm going to add in a very simple basic title. So this title is already added into the video clip, to the timeline actually. And then I'm going to shorten it like this and then bring it to the bottom and change the content. So I'm going to type jump back words something like that and that's all i need to do very simple so once i hit play that's something is going to appear in the middle and this title is going to disappear at the end of the video clearly this is not creative enough so i'm gonna add in some other elements so this is one of the elements that i use in most of my videos yep i'm gonna just drag it to the timeline like this and you know this arrow is kind of big so if you want to have a very big kind of a movement this is okay but i don't like it to be so big so i am going to string so i don't really like those big arrows so i'm gonna shrink it and bring it to the side like this and maybe change the angle a little bit like this and maybe bring it to the back if you want to so jump backwards obviously this is just a very quick example you can do a lot more stuff you want to and after that you have to export this as a GIF format how can you do that pretty simple just go to your timeline and go this icon over here share the project event clip or timeline range and just click on this button and add destination go to compressor settings double click on it and just select built in and go to motion graphics this there are six settings so i'm just gonna choose either animated large or small so i'm just gonna select large because obviously the resolution is higher so after that is done if you're satisfied with the overall results you can always come here and export it under the animated lodge yep and maybe rename the project jump and you can have a quick preview before exporting and if you're satisfied with this you can just go click on next it's going to take a while to you know compress the entire project so please be patient after the project is successfully exported, you can go to the folder and select the file you have exported and press spacebar. Something like that. Pretty simple, isn't it? Obviously, you can also create those GIFs to, you know, send to your friends on your personal websites or, you know, say Telegram. And, you know, same as usual, just go there, export the large animated image and maybe rename sub and export it same as usual you can just select the gif press spacebar hit play and you can export this to your personal website or your telegram or whichever platform that you're using and that's all you need to do pretty simple and that's pretty much all i wanted to show you today and remember again to subscribe to this channel and like this video thank you very much and bye bye